This is the music video of the song Kankulake. The Afro pop tune is sung in Luganda, one of Uganda's national languages. What's special about this is that the singer is not a native speaker of Luganda. Sabrina Herr, known as Dina, is a 24-year-old German woman. She's made a name for herself as a pop star in the East African country of Uganda. What does that actually mean? I don't really know. I don't have a definition. But my songs are on the radio, on TV. People recognize me in the streets. I've already met all the successful people and have sung on big shows. Although Dina spends most of her time in Uganda these days, we meet her in Berlin, where she's just graduated in social work. She's also written a book about her unusual career. It was very important to me to tell my story myself, and it really is very autobiographical. It's about what's happened since 2012. But I also wanted to give a more modern and hopefully more realistic view of an African country. I experienced many things in Uganda that many people in Germany can't even imagine. In 2012, Sabrina Herr spent a year doing voluntary service in Rwanda, a neighboring country of Uganda. Later, she traveled around East Africa and particularly liked the Ugandan capital Kampala. And that's where it started. She was at a bar where they played live music and she began to sing. A music producer happened to be in the audience. He just asked almost jokingly whether we should record something. I said yes and we went to a studio and wrote a song in Luganda. We recorded it and made a video and posted it online. Big media organizations were already ringing the next day. And then it all went really fast. <laughs> Her first song became a hit in 2015. Mumolete means bring him to me in Luganda. But a European singer singing in an African language could also be a source of criticism. I think that people understood really fast that I wasn't just doing this for fun. It's not like I just turned up and started making music like them. They understand that I'm doing it seriously, that I live here and want to live here, that I understand what I'm doing, and that I've got some background knowledge. That's why I don't think I've ever experienced any hostility. I've been received very positively. Dina can now live off the proceeds of her music. She's hoping to expand her fan base in Africa. And her talent for learning languages helps a lot. There are a few more languages coming in 2018. I'm going to release a song in Swahili. I was recently nominated for two awards in Uganda, and I'm really excited about that. The ceremony is in March. And I hope there will be lots of concerts. I've also been invited to a few festivals in Germany, which is nice. There's a lot happening, and I'm looking forward to it. And we can look forward to Dina's new video, Milele, which is currently in the making.